What's up, James? What's up, James? How you doing, man? I'm living living the life, man. How you doing? Doing pretty good. Doing pretty good. So it's obvious that Ray not doing so good after the way it last season ended. So kind of give us an idea how bad are things for him as the second season starts. Oh, Ray, Ray's Ray's finding himself like he's uh, he's dealing with the repercussions of all his actions. You know, Ray Ray's uh, Ray's in a hole. He's holding the shovel and he's looking up. And uh, the question is, is he going to get get out of it, or is he going to keep digging himself deep? That is a huge question. People are going to find that out soon enough when the, when the show comes back. Now, obviously, Renee was a big part of that downfall, but also a big part of his happiness in a way, too, as well. So whether he wants to be or not, how much is he still kind of consumed by her? I think uh, um, <laughs> he, he'd tell you he's not consumed by her, but the truth is, what's Ray thinking about, you know? What's Ray thinking about? Ray's thinking about Renee, you know? And uh, uh, so there is that obsession there. You know, and um, in in some ways that's uh, his Achilles heel, and in other ways it might be a saving grace. Interesting, interesting. Now we know that Ray and Jackie are pretty close, but a lot's changed in both of their lives. We're gonna find that out when the season returns October the seventh on October the seventeenth. Could we kind of see their bond grow stronger, or do you think it's gonna be put to the test this season? I think you got a lot of both. I think uh, uh, any relationship that's put to the test. If you can, if you can come out the other side, you've grown stronger. And and I think uh, Ray and Jackie are two. Uh, you know, they're kind of like star-crossed souls. You know, it's uh, it, it's they're 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 very similar. They they might not acknowledge it or talk about it openly, but they're they're kind of the same people in some ways, dealing with different things in different circumstances. But uh, um, you know, the the relationship between Ray and Jackie is. Uh, I, I just have so much fun. I have so much fun working with Monica. We have so much fun playing with this relationship because it is new and it's different and it's weird and and it's uh it's true and and there's no there's no BS in that. Absolutely, very well put. Well put. Now there's a pretty big reveal involving Renee early on the season. We're not going to spoil it. I know you can't say a whole lot about it. Yeah. But right. Let me ask you this: What was your reaction? when you found out where this story was going and how excited are you for fans to learn about it? Cause it's pretty big. Uh, yeah. That's one of those, Oh shit moments. Uh -huh. <laughs> big time. We all oh, shit. Okay. I, I, uh, like I said, I, I love this season. It's, it's Shakespearean, you know, the stakes are, the stakes are extremely high and, um, Renee's storyline, especially, uh, kind of, uh, it kind of enters into that lady Macbeth kind of world. Oh, that's such a that's such a good comparison. Well done. Mm -hmm. I, I love that. Love that. Now, before I let you go, James, we know that Ray wants nothing more than get his job back with the state police. Just how far do you think he's going to go to be able to make that a reality? Ray, Ray yeah, I'm really glad you brought that up because I think that's the other side of Ray. Here's here's a man who's obsessed with Renee, but he's also obsessed with his job. You know, and I think uh, as an actor, I can relate to that. I, I believe you could relate to that. Any 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 of us who kind of love what we do it becomes who we are and it's not a job anymore and if, if that's stripped away from you you don't know who you are anymore you know Ray's a guy who has sacrificed everything for his job and and I don't necessarily say that in a good way I think he sacrificed his relationship with his his, his son his his ex-wife his family um he sacrificed friendships and uh and with that obsession he also ended up ruining his own job so that's um it's interesting to, to watch him claw his way back. That is spot on, man. And you guys are going to see that happening when High Town returns for a second season, Sunday, October the 17th on Stars. James Badgedale, thank you so much, man, for your time. Appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, dude. Thanks, James.